EA Sports and the PGA Tour proudly present the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today, it's live second-round coverage of the International Challenge. He makes a great pass at the golf ball. It's powerful, but it's rhythmic at the same time. Excellent line, propped up on the short grass. See if our featured player can do something right today. Yeah, when you swing in well, obviously, target looks as, as big as a barn, but on days like today, everything looks difficult. It should be pretty good right there. On the safe side. Terrific golf shot. And now, that for an easy birdie. And getting ready for the putt. Has it. That's birdie. Back to the action here as we get ready to tee off at the par 3 8. The five bunkers surround this green that's perched up. The two really to avoid, they're on the right side. They're incredibly deep pot bunkers. That would be a great look at birdie. This would be nice. Two straight birdies. Continues to roll the ball very well. Frank, how does the front nine finish up with this par four? Well, the par four ninth is called the Monk. It's not overly long, 423 yards, dog leg to the right. Just one bunker down the left to be avoided. Just an ideal lie, Frank. What can he do from here? Well, if he takes advantage of the tee shot now and goes at this flag, then he will certainly gain on the field. This is straight at it. It's a really good line. That is classy. Oh, a chance of going in. They par yesterday. This one for birdie. And who knows? It is a four-round tournament, setting himself up for a good weekend, maybe a great one. The young star makes his birdie. Game's about rhythm. It, when you have good rhythm, it just looks effort, effortless. To hit the ball 300 yards through the air, that easy. Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Early part of this second line, a good approach shot. Now, pretty good chance for birdie. It's a nice snap, right? Just misses. Oh, man. I just pushed it. And that hurts. And the grind out a par here. Needs it. So has the par. Moving on to the next hole in the lead. Frank is very much intact. Frank, here at the 11th hole, what's the best line to take? Got to take it over the middle of that gorse on the left side. Um, so it doesn't look too inviting, but uh, that's where the fairway is. Long and straight. That's how you do it. Impressive play so far into these heavy winds. You could say he's just been breezing through this round. And he steps up to take this shot from the fairway. Frank, in the changing weather conditions, players have so many different options, don't they? Some might like to play it high. Others might want to play it a little lower along the ground. You've really got to be on your toes today because of that, Rich. And really, that's what separates the men from the boys, so to speak. Um, you know that any mistake you make can obviously be magnified by, by the wind conditions. But conversely, it's a real good chance for skill to shine. Wow, if you get robbed. No, it's like kissing your mother-in-law. That's a bogey, but still in the lead. When we start to see shots in hand, really valuable. Frank, how do you size up the 12th hole here at Royal Troon? 
Well, first look at 430 yards, you'd think it'd be a rather easy par four. But that's not really the issue. The issue is gorse right and left. Good tee shot, good lie, and now a good chance to take advantage here on this hole. Second shot, good look at the green. Down, little Sheba, down! So the second of the par four goes begging, and now I'll have to rely on the short game. But the short game, as we all know, can redeem a lot of mistakes. See if he does it here. Workman like hole, he walks away with a par. There you have it. The second round is complete. Another solid effort put together, and it shows on the scorecard. And after two rounds, you really start to see uh, not only who's playing well, but who's consistent. 